what's the vibes i had to get the camera right what's up y'all it's your girl kella and we're back with another vlogster if you're new here girl that is not the intro if you're not new here what's good what's going on okay so today is march 1st and it's officially the month of the baddies big purr i'm so excited y'all that it's finally my birthday month I literally ain't got too much together, but I'm still excited it's March because like March also means like it's about to start getting warm outside and we get it closer just to hot girl spring, hot girl summer. So it's just kind of like, uh, it's just like a little wave of excitement or whatever. So today y'all know I went to work. If y'all watched the last vlog, the vlog literally ended this morning and I started the new vlog now. It is about to be six o'clock. I got home earlier. I just laid down, edited a um, TikTok video, posted that. Now we're up and we're about to get started on washing some wigs because I promised myself that I would get this done. And why do I always start vlogs with a bunny on it? Every single time. Is it really a vlog for me if I don't start the, the vlog looking crazy? But anyways, okay, so these are the um, wigs, I'm about to say vlogs. These are the wigs that I plan on going ahead and like washing and selling. I really don't even know how many wigs in here. If I had to guess, it's maybe like five or six possibly more than that but i didn't even show y'all or tell y'all y'all i don't have any room or space these wigs are overflowing so like i gotta do this like i may not be in the mood but i gotta do it y'all i have wigs up here i can't even reach up here i got wigs up there above the damn microwave and i got wigs up here and it's covered both sides y'all know i can't reach that right now but i have wigs everywhere i got wigs under the under the little thing in the sofa i got wigs in the bathroom closet i just have wigs everywhere so i'm about to just go ahead and see if i can go ahead and get these up off of me but first and foremost i need to make sure like this not really like the the ones that i would want to give away because i said i wanted to give some wigs away when i hit 10k so i would tell y'all to go ahead and let me know which wigs that y'all think i should give but by the time y'all see this, I'm going to be not already picked the wigs that I'm going to sell. I kind of, I don't know about this wig right here. I had her on for not too long. But like something about like colorful curly wigs that just don't be the best to me. Like it's not bad, but like, you know, like when you get a colored wig, it just don't be as good as like a black wig. I don't know. How long did I, I had this wig on for less than a week? Maybe? No. About a week. I don't remember, girl. Anyways... This what we working with. We got all the colors of the rainbow. <laughs> Girl. Oh, we this um sank strong. Y'all just pour some bleach down there because why do I keep seeing next? I didn't seen three so far and it ain't even um hot outside yet. What's really going on? Like I'm not here for this. And like I knew it was coming because I've been telling y'all, but still like I just them nets really be driving me crazy. Like, I be seeing them, I be in this bitch itching. Like, come on. I don't got time for that. Ain't seen a net all winter. As soon as they want to get a sprinkle of little spring weather, here they come. Nah, I need to probably wash these dishes ASAP. But it's only dishes from this morning that when I was making them uh, pancakes. So, like, you know, it ain't nothing that stink or whatever. But, child, you don't even want to get a nest. No type of reason to be here. And I got them flowers in my room. I feel like they attracted them too. But the rundown for this weekend, I really, really, really would like to go to the mall. Um, I So I think I'm going to do that. And I think I said that on the last vlog, it ended up not making it to the mall. But tomorrow, I really feel like I need to go to the mall. Only because I'm not finding like stuff online when I shop. So like that's on the to-do list. Hair collabs is on the to-do list. I think that's really it like i don't really have nothing else to do this weekend nor do i really want to do anything because y'all know me i be like oh i want to do something i want to hang out but like this weekend i am totally content with not doing anything except for what i need to do like that that's all i want to do this weekend child i don't really want to do anything for real this week dragged the fuck out of me <laughs> like she dragged me oh and bmf comes on tonight so girl i might just pop me some popcorn like i'm about to watch a movie and watch bmf i think usually when a new season comes out what i'd like to do is i like to go back and watch like the last two episodes of the last season just so i could kind of like refresh my memory on what's going on and then i'll be able to like start the new episode like knowing everything so that's gonna be something that i probably do tonight 
it's either that I'll do that tonight or I'll do it Sunday. But then again, knowing me, I will watch a show twice. So I'll probably watch it tonight and Sunday just to give myself something to watch before it's time for me to like reset for the week. I don't really know. But I'm really excited about it because it looks like it's going to be good. They got everybody in this season, girl. Can't wait. All right, let me stop lollygagging and really get into it. I know for a fact I'm going to sell this one because I ain't even really wear this one. So I'm about to go ahead and get this one done. Go ahead and check out my Depop if you guys haven't um, like followed me on there already. I'm going to go ahead and link it. Well, it's already linked in the bio, actually. So check the link in the bio. Going forward, I really want to try to start selling at least two to three ways a week. Like, so just be on the lookout. Because I know y'all been asking me for a minute, and I have been stalling. I don't know what it is about cleaning these wigs, child, but something just be in me like, I don't want to do it. But we're doing it, so be on the lookout. Only been a few husbands for like days. Only been days, but it felt like months. We come for you, only go like once. Fast and you do what you want. I guess I'm doing what I want. Hope you know what you want. What you want? Y'all, I'm over here watching the TikTok dating show. I haven't watched it in so long, y'all. And I'm eating another salad from Zaxby's because it was just too good the last time I had it. But y'all, I haven't watched this in so long. Like, I forgot how funny it was. Like, so right now she got a man on there. He not like, he's slow, but he not slow. I think he just got a speech impediment or whatever. Um, and when I say people on TikTok so freaking rude, that's not what I be laughing at. Like, I don't laugh at those. But like the lady herself, like she be cracking jokes with like the person that she's on there with, and he kind of like cracking jokes too. Like it's just funny amongst them. But one thing I can't say is I really, really hate. TikTok comments sometimes because people really don't care about what they say and who they say it to. Like, people are reading this. Like, why are you being so mean and rude? I would never understand that. I just cannot ever. Like, even I see stuff I don't like every single day. But I'm never about to be commenting under somebody's stuff. Like, just being rude and hateful. That shit is crazy to me. But anyways, um, I came on here to let y'all know I finished the wigs. When I say that shit is very like time consuming, my back hurt, my fingers shriveled up. Let me show y'all why I didn't put the wigs there so they could dry because I refuse to hand dry them, okay? I was about to get the wigs posted tonight, but I just kind of want to wait until they're all dry. That way, like once it's time for like people to see it, like, you know, they're not getting mailed out ASAP. They got to dry, which is going to take about two business days. But <laughs> I got all the wigs hanging in the shower. And if y'all was wondering where I put that eucalyptus at, it's up there, child. But I just hung them up in the shower because that just seemed like the best route. That's usually what I do with my own wigs. So hopefully, like, within the next... Hell, hopefully by the end of Sunday, they are dry. And then I could just go ahead and start packaging them and, like, just waiting on people to buy them, child, so they can go. I'm ready for them to get up out of here. I got to make space. We got to make space for when we when we move. We don't need all this stuff in a way because we're speaking it into existence. We're getting up out of here. And I just don't need nothing straggling around. I might get to selling all types of stuff on Depop. So go ahead and don't, go and look on that. Now. I don't know. But um, tomorrow, I'm just trying to plan my day out. I want to be like at the mall when it open. But I forgot. I didn't even do my hair tonight. And I'm not going to because I don't feel like it. Because I don't feel like doing my makeup. But I have to do this wig tomorrow. I'm kind of scared of this. What made me agree to this? I don't know. This wig smells good though. It smells like they're already washing and everything. But I'm probably going to pluck that tonight. And wake up at like 8 or 9 and do my um hair. That way I can be to the mall at 11 when they open. So that's what I got going on for the night. I just wanted to come back in and check in with y'all. Let y'all know what, what's going on. But I'm probably just going to see y'all in the morning. I'll do a little bit behind the scenes of me doing my hair. So I'll see y'all tomorrow. And we're going to go shopping. <laughs> I think I like this a little life. I think I <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. 
we are up i did not pluck this wig last night girl but i'm finna do it right now it's 8 30 in the morning and i want to be done by like right at 11 could do because the mall opens at 11 but i am like hungry but i'm not hungry so i'm about to make me a smoothie i haven't made a smoothie in a minute you know it's been a, it's been a long time keep it real with you Exactly. Hold up. These are all the fruits I got. I ain't got no more pineapple. Oh, I had forgot to show y'all these. Hold on, brother. Um, a long one. But I forgot to show y'all that I. No, I didn't forget to show y'all that. I definitely did like a little haul after I came home. I didn't give y'all a review on these. Is what I did. Too. So these right here. I don't even know why I thought I would like them because I didn't even like the true fruit ones. I don't like frozen fruit. I just don't like frozen fruit. It does it, they don't taste the best to me, and I hate having to like crunch on them. So I just literally ate the chocolate off of them and called it a day. But these, these if you like frozen fruit, then these are really good. But I don't like frozen fruit. I don't know why I still got them in the refrigerator, but I mean, freezer, but they just don't stand until I feel like throwing them away. But eating that made me want to get like a um cookies and cream Hershey bar because that was my favorite, 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 favorite candy growing up. It was that and gummy bears. That's all the only kind of candy I would ever want to eat. Um, but anyways, back to the smoothie. I don't have no pineapples, and that'd be like a big part of my smoothie. Oh, and these look freezer burn. Y'all know like when, when something been in the freezer too long, it just be iced up like <sighs> These pizzas still smell good though. They smell fresh. And it's crazy because they not. I might as well just make all of these. I feel like I should break it up with some water first. Yeah, I'm gonna drop this shit. Okay, it came right apart. Oh, oh man, I'm dropping them. I feel like I should just make all of them. Like, that's it. Ain't nobody got time to put that little bit back in the uh, freezer. I can't stand when people do that too. And I do that to myself all the time. Like, I'm the only person who lives here and I would literally put this much like juice back in the refrigerator. They'd be mad at myself like, why would I do that? For some reason, I really want to add this to my smoothie today. It is the orange peach mango juice from Trader Joe's. And I feel like it would be good because I got peaches in here. And a little like orange since it's like morning time. And then... Can't forget my honey. What? Oh, I like to add the honey at the end because I noticed that when I add it in the beginning, it just be getting stuck like everywhere. It just don't be blending in well. Do y'all be caring about aesthetics? Like if I was to stop talking right here and make this like a montage, do y'all care about that? Because sometimes I be feeling like I used to do nothing but montages on my channel. Like nothing but. And now I've moved so far from montages that I will have a whole vlog of talking and no montages. Don't get me wrong. I have montages every other video probably. But like I just don't be feeling the need to do them anymore because I just rather talk through. Do y'all care? Let me know. What's y'all preference? What's y'all preference? Because I don't really mind either one. I just, I don't know. I just be going with the flow, bro. And these nails. I've been wanting to tell y'all about these nails and I don't know how I keep forgetting. Okay, so y'all know on the last vlog. Or was it the vlog before the last vlog? I had a horror story with these nails. And y'all, this is by far the worst set that I've ever had. Like, they look good to the eye, like, from a, from a distance. But up close, they, is, they looking crazy. And they chipping and everything. Like, my nails never do that. Like, this nail is chipped and the polish is coming off. Like, I don't... Can y'all see? Hold on, let me... Like, it's chipped and the polish is coming. Like, what? What's going on? This one chipping polish coming like she really didn't give a fuck and she won't be touching my nails again we're gonna use this cup today oh this is a little thick y'all i didn't uh threw away the the glass straw oh no this too thick girl i didn't throw away the glass straw for this because i couldn't clean it so i just had to let her go you gotta let it go Come on, dang, I should have I should have put a little more juice in here. This is too thick, girl. Hold on. It's Priscilla Renee. Priscilla Renee? Do you know Priscilla? Hello? 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 Okay, I'm over here watching Poor Minds and y'all like my time management is just either not good or like I just took my time today and it might be a mixture of the both of those. But it is eleven eighteen. I wanted to leave this house at eleven o'clock at the latest. And we have not even started yet on this week collab. 
first and foremost it took me forever to pluck this wig i had wanted to bleach it but it just gives i don't want to say it gives synthetic but like this is clearly with these colors this is clearly not all human hair so i just didn't feel like it would take well to me it wouldn't take well to me bleaching the night so i just decided not to and like it took me forever to pluck it and as y'all can see it's barely plucked like Anyways, I have my setup going on my phone right here. I'm going to do the angle this way. I have realized that this lighting be really harsh sometimes. And, like, I don't like that. And it also be hurting my eyes, too. So, like, ugh. I wonder. Oh, I was about to say, I wonder if that's conflicting. But I got it this way. So, it's really not conflicting for real. And I'm starving. Y'all haven't ate nothing because I don't really have nothing that I could just, like, eat real fast. Everything in, in this house has to be cooked. So like, uh, can't do that. Okay, I hope this wig fits my head well, cause the last wig that I had from, I think it was this company, it was bulging up. Let me go ahead and cut the ear tabs off. This is a whole bunch of lace. <sighs> I forgot to even come back and do my makeup on camera with y'all, cause I'm just like, it's no way it's taking me this long. Like, why is it taking me this long? I hate when. I take too long to do my content because it's starting to feel like work. It's starting to feel like work. And my weekends need not consist of working. We've done that all week. I just need this to feel fun. I'm trying to think about what I even want to eat. I'm starved, babe. But I'll just come back. I think I might do like a little side part with this. That's kind of what it's giving. What is the middle? I'll just come back once my hair is done simply to save time because I don't have to keep turning the camera on and off and all that. I need to get out this house. Okay. BRB. Okay, we finally done. How are you guys feeling about her? I think she's cute. Um, I always be real skepti skeptical about wigs until I actually put them on my head. I like it. I don't know. Like it. It's cute. It's different. I don't like this though. I wish the baby head didn't have this color in it because it, it looks weird. It looks like it's just not supposed to be right there. I might need to put a little bit more makeup on the lace, but honestly, I don't really care. I don't I don't really give a fuck. It's cute and it's and it was only for video purposes. I don't really plan to like go all out with this hair. I'm not taking no pictures. It is what it is. Put a little more sunlight in here. I feel like it ain't got dark um right here. But now it is 12:44. We are an hour and 44 minutes behind schedule, but it's okay. It's all right. It's not like I always put myself on these time limits. And y'all should know this by now. I always put myself on time limits, and I never really reach those time steps. And when I do, I be super proud of myself. But sometimes they be a little, they be a little bit unrealistic, and it's okay. Like the reason I wanted to get to the mall right when they first opened, just because it just be crazy. Y'all know I hate the mall on Saturdays. Friday is my mall day, but since I have to go to work now on Fridays, it just doesn't work out for me. So, we have to go on the Saturday. So, with that, I'm just going to have to, shit, get in and out. Go in there, get what I need, and hopefully people not in my motherfucking way. What I want to wear today? I think it's cold outside. Oh, girl, 55 degrees. It's getting warm, though, y'all. Like, it's about to be warm. Yeah, only thing I hate, though. Is that transition from winter to spring is it always got to rain. It's so many days of rain on the forecast. I don't know if y'all can see, but child, we reaching the 70s. We reaching the 70s, and I'm here for it. I love a little hot weather, anything to show off this block. Okay. Yeah, I need to get my ass in the gym. <laughs> Damn, what am I about to put on? I'm really tempted to put on one of them, um... Uh, Target sets, but I I've been doing that a little too much. They gonna say, "Damn, this bitch must ain't got no clothes." But we all know, <laughs> we all know I got clothes. <laughs> Hell, too many. Okay, what can I wear today? What can I wear today? I def it's definitely giving two piece set for real, for real though, y'all. Cause I'm about to go be trying stuff on, and y'all already know how that is. That's aggravating when you got a got on too much clothes and you trying to try shit on. So I really just need like. A little, maybe like a little one piece. Do I got a one piece? I got that shit in one piece, but I don't feel like having my cleavage just all out today. I don't know. Let me figure this out because now I'm taking even more time.
talking to y'all. I'm going to just come back probably when we get in the car. Or I might just come back when I get to the mall. I need to go get food first, actually. But you don't know me. Pay me attention. I told y'all Atlanta Radio really be late. But um, we went and got some Chipotle roll. This is really what I was craving. And it's really rare when I start to crave Chipotle. That's how I know I really want it. So let's get into it. Hold on. Let me take these rubber bands out. Put my hand sanitizer on. But y'all, I smell so freaking good right now. I put on that Marc Jacobs um, Perfect. I haven't worn that in I don't know how long. And I don't even know what well, I do know why. Because I'm literally down to the last little bit. So I guess I be trying to savor it. But it smells so freaking good like i just been smelling myself ever since i left the house i need to add that to the list of like fragrances that i need to re-up on because she's a winner okay winner winner let's see what we got i'm trying to hurry up because i invited um bianca to come to the mall with me but she got to be somewhere at like four o'clock i think so and told her i needed to give me some food first this one 118 damn come on okay so I got, we real plain and simple over here, child. I got a chicken bowl with rice, um, a little bit of hot sauce, sour cream, cheese, and a lettuce. That's it. That's all. And I got me a little vinaigrette on the side. Oh, y'all, this is so difficult to eat in the car. Wait, I should have got a thumbnail. Can't forget the thumbnails, bro. I always be forgetting the thumbnails. I need to get my car cleaned out anyway, but that's no reason for me to make a mess. Got to get a chip. Got to get a chip. Okay. Mm. Yeah, if somebody <coughs> was sitting in the car next to me, you should keep looking at me. I don't care. Why are you sitting here, girl? I'm eating. Mm. Forgot you. I usually really hate vinaigrette. Because vinaigrette stuff smell like feet to me. I don't care what nobody say. But that vinaigrette, it do got that little smell to it, but it's good. It, had like a, it got like a barbecue -y taste to it. Like, am I the only one who think that? Like, is that... Yeah, I think that they have like a different little vibe. I don't know. Damn, little lady. <laughs> you sure can't put it away. Oh, I got some packages that just came. What did I order? Oh, I remember. And I do agree with Jai. If you eat one a whole one of these, you is greedy. Your back is big. <laughs> you so much food. Alright, I'll come back. This is not a mukbang. <laughs> successful shopping day at Cumberland I got some stuff actually got a lot of things but I'm unsure about them like they're cute but they're not like oh yes and when I get something I want to feel like oh yes like oh I got something good and I don't know how I feel about it like it's cute but it ain't it ain't giving like no wow factor so what I'm about to do right now is I'm about to go to a whole different mall I'm about to go to perimeter because I want to go to Zara. Because I feel like Zara is going to have something. I know it may be a bit pricey. But they're going to have something in there. So I'm going to go there. And then I'm going to check out their Edge over there. And see if they have something. Because the Edge and this one. Like everybody didn't have nothing. Like why is it that everybody still has winter and, and fall clothes? Spring is here. It's March. Why has nobody dropped a spring collection except for Forever 21? I'm genuinely confused. It's like, damn, when you're ready to, like, buy something, they don't have nothing. And when, when you're trying to save or if you, you're broke, you see everything in the world that you want. Like, what's going on? So, yeah, on the way to a whole different mall, I'm hoping that they're not busy or packed surprisingly Cumberland wasn't that deep like it looked like it's a lot of people and it's like a lot of like traffic in the parking like garage 
But every store we went in, like, we was in and out of there. Like, I, no line, no no nothing crazy. We was literally in and out of every single store. So that's good. Bianca got me wanting some ice cream now. She was talking about a blizzard, and now I can't stop thinking about one. I really don't need that. I need to cut back on my sugar intake. Because that's what's doing it to me. Like, my sugar intake right now has been, like, off the chain. Hell, I felt a little bit uncomfortable trying on the clothes that I did try on today. Like... I was just looking at myself like, girl, we got to get together. <laughs> I don't know what it's going to take. Because clearly looking in the mirror ain't enough. <laughs> okay, we back at the house. I'm going to show y'all um, the stuff that I got. I wasn't going to, but I think I'm honestly going to be taking this shit back. I don't know. Like, I don't know. This is not what I envisioned to have. So we're going to see. Um, I ended up going to Perimeter. They didn't have a thing in Zara again no spring stuff like that no spring colors everything is nudes browns tans blacks white i don't know what's going on i guess spring just doesn't exist this year in georgia so there's that um but i found this cover up at uh forever 21 this is the bottoms and then i believe it's supposed to go with the top that i ended up getting from the other forever 21 because yep it is it goes perfectly i wonder why they didn't have the bottoms in the other one so it's like a little skirt and then this is the top that it goes with. I honestly didn't even plan on finding no bottoms for this. Because I was going to wear this with a bathing suit. I think I'm going to keep this. Because this is actually really cute. And then what else did I get? Let's see. So I got these jeans. They fit so freaking good. But they have these like seashells on the back of them. I think I might just keep these just because. Even if I do take the others back. But. These are the jeans. They're like a, it says 90s fit. It do give that kind of vibe. Got a little distressing at the bottom. But these right here go with this top. This is the top. So it's like a jean, um, what is this called? Bikini top. And I'm not like the biggest fan of it, but I think that it was cute on me. And it goes really well with the pants, of course. But like, I'm not trying to give like jean outfit on vacation that's not giving tropical to me like although it has like a seashell on it it's still just like jeans on vacation like it, is, it just ain't sitting well it ain't sitting well and um i forget i might well show y'all everything um i got this bathing suit which i think i am gonna keep whether i wear it on vacation or not it's just super cute it's pink and orange and it's crazy because i wasn't about to get this because I already ordered an orange bathing suit. But I was like, fuck it, it is what it is. That's why I said I'm going to just keep it whether or not I go on vacation with it. But this. And then this is the top for it. And then don't go to the mall with Bianca. Because honestly, y'all, I was about to put all this shit back. Because I just wasn't feeling any of it. I, the only thing I really was going to get was the bathing suit. But um, I also saw this little cargo dress. And I just, it just caught my eye, like, out the blue, child. It just caught my eye. And it was actually really cute. On the only thing I just could not think of is, like, what kind of shoes am I going to wear with this? Like, I don't see it with tennis shoes. I also don't really see it with heels. So, we're just going to have to see because it might be going back as well. I don't know. I just got it, child. And then, lastly, oh, no, I had got some of these as well, some little pasties. And then, lastly... I um, got something from Akira, and this shirt was like five dollars, child. So I just got it just because it's like whether I wear it on vacation or not. I'm I just wanted to get it, but I feel like I probably could pull off a look with this. Like this is a cute little top, and again, it was only five dollars. So I was like, fuck it. Like if I don't wear it on vacation, I'm gonna wear it sometime soon. I actually, have some blue heels. I wonder if this is the same color blue. I don't know. Oh my god, but y'all wait. I was at Perimeter, which is the second mall that I went to when I was at Forever 21. And this girl was like, you short, you smaller in person. And I was looking a little confused. She was like, I be watching your videos. I was like, oh my God. Like, girl, one thing about me, y'all, I have resting bitch face. And I know I be looking crazy as hell. Especially like when I'm outside at the mall and shit. Because people, if you don't look like a bitch, they think they can approach you. So I just be having my mean girl face on. But I automatically kind of have this, like, resting bitch face. But whenever somebody talks to me, I try to just kind of, like, 
brighten it up a little bit or whatever so when she said that, i'm just like oh my god hey like thank you or whatever and um she said her name was cassidy so girl cassidy if you're watching this what's up girl that is the second person that i've met the first girl that i had met i met her months ago and i couldn't even get her name or nothing because we was like outside and we was like in passing but that really feel good like now i'm starting to meet some of y'all that is like <laughs> what but that made my day that really made my day because i kind of did have an attitude by the time i got to that second mall and then for, for 21 because i just feel like when you want to spend money there's just nothing i've already said that but still like i just can't believe like i can't find anything that i just really like but i told Kmo, i literally just got the phone came i said girl I'm going to keep looking online, but I'm not going to keep stressing myself out. The only reason I'm stressing myself out about these outfits is because my whole mindset is content, content, content. Like, I'm doing, I'm not going on a trip because of content, but, like, I planned this trip, and it's only me and her. And I'm like, I have so much time to actually get content that I'm like, I want to put a lot of effort into it. And, like, I'm trying to, and it's not working, so... I just said at the end of the day, I can never go wrong with being chill but cute. And the push is just going to hit regardless. So, it is what it is. Like, I'm not about to keep stressing that. So. But anyways, I'm about to eat some more of my Chipotle. And I think I'm about to go ahead and watch Be A Myth. Because everybody online keeps talking about it. And I'm like, damn. I'm going to be in a new way happen before I can even watch it myself. So, I'm about to go ahead and watch that. I'm trying to think, do I want to do another wig collab tonight? Because my makeup is done, clearly. And it's definitely got to go. Like, it's cute, but I'm not the biggest fan of it. It's, it's all right. So, yeah. That's everything from the mall. And then, shit, I'll probably be back later. I'll probably be back tomorrow. Because I ain't doing nothing else for the rest of the day, for real. If we be fan, I got you. All right, y'all. It's hours later. It is 8.57. And I, I'm tired. And I just look so pooped and exhausted. Like, I just look sleepy. I kind of am, but like, not as sleepy as I look. But anyways, child, I decided that I wanted to like get up and edit. So I brought my ass in this kitchen and I'm sitting here and I'm about to edit. Um, And I made me a little drink to kind of like motivate me to like just have a vibe and like, you know. So I have, excuse me. I have um the orange peach mango juice and my champagne. And then I garnished it with one of them little nasty strawberries, pine berries, whatever you want to call it. Isn't she cute? And it's good. So I'm going to just be sipping on that while I edit. Hopefully I can get done editing by like 11 or 12. 12 is going to be my max out. So I have to really get, get to it. I had to get to it because I want to have this video done and post it by tomorrow. I was supposed to do my hair again tonight, but that's not happening. I don't know how many times I've said that, but it's not happening. And if you know me, then you probably knew that wasn't happening, you know? And that's all right. I got on live for like 20 minutes because I just wanted to talk. So I got on live, talked to a couple of people. That was cool or whatever. And now we're about to edit. I've really been starting on editing, y'all. I have, I don't feel like it, but I know I need to. BRB. Well, see y'all tomorrow for real. <laughs> y'all i'm up and i'm watching church i decided to kind of go back to my old church this morning because like it was the first video that popped up as soon as i got on youtube and i was like let's give it another shot so we're watching that and we're also about to make us some breakfast y'all i have been hooked on pancakes and my job i have never really been a pancake girl i'm more of a waffle girl but like these pancakes have been busting so i'm about to eat that some eggs and then watch church after that i need to clean these dishes and clean up a little bit um, as far as today goes, I don't know if I'm going to get this done, but what I like to do, I like to get a wig collab done. And then after that, I like to go to the store and get like some healthy things to eat for this week. Cause my ear has just been a little bit out of control. It's not going to be like the healthiest stuff. Like it's not giving me on a diet, but it's going to give healthier options. So I want to go get some stuff. And then after that, I want to go see camo and my godchild so that is what i have planned and hope that's how my day goes so hopefully that's how it goes so let's get into it and i'll come back and talk to y'all a little bit later he says you are like a tree planted by streams of water can i just decree prophetically what the next season of your life looks like you are going to be like a tree planted by streams.
All right, it's currently 3.11. Once I finish, um, like, cleaning up, y'all, I, I lay down with the intention of just kind of, like, taking, like, a little 30-minute break. But, y'all, I ended up falling to sleep. Like, out of nowhere, I just became so tired and sleepy. So, I was out for the count. Then I had, like, woke up and I had set my alarm clock for, like, 3 o'clock. Because I'm like, I'm still kind of tired, so I might as well just go ahead and stay asleep or whatever. But I'm up now, clearly, in the car. I'm about to go to Kroger so I could get me some groceries for this week. I'm going to get some stuff to cook tonight and just some, um, actually, I'm going to get two things to cook. So I want a meal prep for the week. Um, I'm going to cook mashed potatoes, broccoli, and um baked chicken that's gonna be like my lunch every day this week at work and then for my um dinner at home i want to do like some chicken wraps um so i'm gonna do that i saw the i saw them on instagram and the girl like she just basically kind of did what she wanted to do put inside of the chicken wraps so i'm gonna basically do the same thing so that's the two things that i'm gonna cook i want to get like some healthy snacks some fruit some stuff like that i don't know i just I already told y'all I'm on like getting some healthier stuff because I feel like that's why I be feeling like uh too because like I've been eating a lot of junk food like a lot I still have that damn Valentine's Day candy in my house and y'all I've been eating the fuck out of it like I've been eating Twix and Skittles every single day and Reese's it's unacceptable so I'm probably gonna be throwing those candies away once I get back home because I shouldn't be eating it I'm gonna be some fruit or something, girl, to eat on. But um, also, I told y'all that I wanted to do my hair. I don't think that's gonna happen if I don't feel like doing it later. I just, I'm just not, I'm not in the mood. And y'all know me. If I'm not in the mood, I ain't doing it. It is what it is. And plus, I just have so many other things to do. I told Kmo that I would come over there, and then we'll be taking a nap. It's like I gotta go to the store, and then I'm gonna go over there. Like it's, the hair collab just ain't fitting in my day. Theory, and it's more important for me to go see Camo and Kylo. So I'm about to, as soon as I finish like getting my groceries and stuff, I'm gonna head over there and then I'll just, of course, cook once I get back home. So that's just what my day is about to consist of, child. I feel a little, uh, I feel like my period about to come on, but the app, hold on, let me see. I got eight days left, but I definitely am one of the girls who get all my symptoms like well before my period even comes. So that might be why I just had like a little sleep attack and I'm feeling a little, mm. Y'all, I was so tired that I forgot to put my rubber bands back in my mouth. After I ate my breakfast, I forgot to put my rubber bands back in my mouth. And I'm like, oh my God. And mind y'all, I haven't done that in a long time. Like, I've been on my piece. I've been on my P's and Q's when it comes to my, my uh, rubber bands. Like, I have been putting them boys back in my mouth as soon as I'm done with them. Like, I ain't been playing no games. So, like, I woke up, like, so bad at myself because, like, what the heck? Oh, and then I don't even know how I forgot to even talk about this. So, um, church. I don't even have really church notes for y'all. Um, church was about, I guess mainly money like money was the was the the topic of it and he said he gonna be talking about money for the next three sermons or whatever next three sundays but you know basically like overall he was just saying like stop thinking that church is all about giving pastors money like we know in the past that that's happened before but you should still be putting away money for god like you put money away for that call you want you put money away for everything you want blah 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 you know so you know pay your tithes pay your offerings and, and all of those things you know serve God in that way as well which I understand and I got but it's so I don't know what it was but that sermon did not like touch me while I understood it it didn't touch me and I was like okay because y'all know I said I would give them I was like oh let me just watch them I'm gonna give them another chance today and it didn't touch me like I don't know if it's because I went into it with like I'm already kind of done with the church or like if it just truly just wasn't in for me I don't really know and it's so crazy because ebony texted me like literally right before i left the house because we was texting like earlier today and she had asked me she was like did you watch church today she was like i actually think like this is my last time watching that church because when the first lady was talking she said ho like the word ho <laughs> and like of course i don't know what they was talking about like i don't know you know what i'm saying but I mean, 
that ain't my reason but i do feel like why would she be saying that you know like you could say something else like what would they be saying girl like jezebel or something like that but she said that and i'm just like oh wow and i told her i'm like that's crazy that you bring up church and you say that because i literally told myself like yeah that's probably gonna be my last it's gonna be my last um time watching that church because it, it wasn't doing anything for me like like i said i understood it but it just it wasn't it for me so i think i'm just going to continue to just watch change church because i actually really like that um church and yeah that's that's just what we're gonna we're gonna go with i'm also kind of glad i kind of waited to go is this handicap come on uh, papa oh girl i got me a, a spot right in the front i'm kind of glad i waited to come to kroger because now um, it's not as many people like the parking lot, even a little, you know, a little, you know, not not busy. So I'm here for it, right? Period. But let's get in and out. I'm literally only buying what I need for this week and possibly like a couple snacks, and that'll be it. So um, I don't know. I probably recording that a little bit, not too too much. okay so i ended up getting me some mandarin just because i really um like the last one is last ones that i got but i hate having to pill them myself so i got the ones in the cup that's one of my healthy snacks i got the one with no sugar addy so yeah i got some potatoes to cook green beans instead of broccoli because i said i was getting broccoli but i just ended up getting these because i haven't ate green beans in a long time tortilla strips lettuce for my wraps what else go with that i got some jalapenos and banana peppers for the wraps and then i wanted to use like a different type of sauce for the wraps as well so i was like let's just try something different i got some pesto garlic if i don't like this i have caesar and ranch in there so we'll see how that goes um as far as like the rest of my healthy snacks i got bananas grapes of course um not so healthy snack these these just my thing right now they just my vibe you know um let's see oh healthy snack these y'all know i get these all the time but i usually get blueberry then i got these they be having these at work and i actually really like them so i went ahead and bought them for myself so as y'all can see i'm trying with my healthy snacks i got one unhealthy thing but like I said, we're not on a diet. We're just trying to choose better habits here. You know, I'm not on an intentional diet. Um, grits. Y'all know I love to eat grits for work in the morning. Chicken to cook. I needed some more butter. I like to use the Country Crock brand. Cinnamon rolls. Something else that's a little bit unhealthy. But I just keep seeing it on my timeline. I don't know why, but that's one thing about me. If I keep seeing something over and over again, I'd be like, oh, I got to go get that. So I got it um as far as drinks go i really wanted some damn capri suns but y'all why are capri suns almost five dollars a box like i remember when it was like 199 what's it's it's sickening it's really sickening so i ended up getting me some gatorades these are my favorite gatorades actually got me some uh celsius i haven't bought these in so long y'all so i ended up getting three of these y'all know my favorite one is the ocean vibe I ended up getting some more floss because the last pack of floss that I got from Target, I got the cheaper brand and it showed it, it just was getting stuck all in my braces and it just was not it. So I actually had to get like a good brand of um floss. So I got the Oral B brand. So there's that. And then lastly, I got this for my car. Y'all know I am stuck on that green one. The Paradise one, that's my favorite, favorite scent for my car. But y'all know, like, those really be, like, hit or miss. It's like either I see a whole bunch of them or I don't see them at all. And I haven't seen it the last couple of times I went to Target. So, I just said F it and got this one because it's time for me to, like, put something new in my car. This one is the Ocean scent. It's, I mean, it smells good. It's just not what I wanted. Oh, wait. No, that's not the last thing. I got some flushable wipes. 
I got the Kroger brand, and then I also ended up getting the Kroger brand. Kroger brands of makeup wipes because I really, really needed some. I don't have any, and I don't plan on going to Target none this week. So I just, I just settled for these. Hopefully, hopefully they good. I don't know. I, I, yeah, that. And then I also got paper towels and water. They sitting on the floor. I'm not about to pick that up and show y'all, y'all. So that's everything that I got. I'm about to go ahead and hurry up and put this stuff up. Now I'm kind of mad that I didn't get something that I could kind of like quickly eat because I'm hungry right now. So they're probably gonna have to stop again. I'm gonna have to call Kim and see if they ate. If not, I'm gonna have to um get her something too. But um, I'll just come back later. I'll probably cook with y'all. And if I don't cook with y'all, I'm just gonna show y'all like me meal prepping or whatever. But um, I might take y'all over there too so y'all can see uh Kylo or whatever. So yeah, see y'all later. He living outside. <laughs> he trying to get the phone. He like phones, y'all. He got a whole playpen. He been turning up. What you doing way up here? You gotta get one last look at the sun. Nope. Nope. Look, Jesse, I know it's Okay, y'all. It is child, what time is it? 9.42. And I'm just now getting done with cooking. Girl, cooking is just a chore sometimes, especially when you don't feel like doing it, because it can be fun. Sometimes I do enjoy it, but today I was not in a cooking mood. But we got it, well, almost done. Well, no, we got it done. So I did my mashed potatoes already. I did my chicken, and I just finished my green beans. And it's so crazy to me, because I used to hate green beans growing up, but I realized I just didn't like the way my mama cooked them. So the way that I cook them is I go ahead and like, as soon as I get them, I cut them and then I broil them in some beef broth and chicken broth. So like a mixture of both and a little bit of water. So I broil them first and I don't let them get like too soft. And then once I'm done with that, I'll drain that and then I'll season them and add a whole bunch of like garlic because I realized I like garlicky um, green beans that I made a lot. And then I'll fry them. To make them like a little bit crispy. And they just be so good. So maybe it's not that you don't like it. You're just not eating it right. Or getting it cooked right. Okay. So we got that done. This is what my meal prep is looking like. If y'all can't already see. So mashed potatoes, chicken, and green beans. Monday through Thursday. And then y'all know Friday. I don't be at work long enough to even make it to lunch. So... I don't really need that and then I cook some chicken breast so I'm about to cut this up and put it in a container as well that way like once I get home <clears throat> for dinner I could just put it inside the lettuce wrap and put the toppings on it and then that's gonna be dinner and I think that's really perfect for me because I don't be hungry when I get home like I just be in a mood for a little snack and that would just that would be like the perfect little snack for me to eat so now i'm trying to figure out if i want to like go ahead and start putting the fruit and stuff inside a ziploc bag it's like if i'm a meal prep like we might as well get two you know so i might as well go ahead and like actually get everything together that way like in the morning i could just grab and go grab and go so we got all of that done i'm about to wash the dishes i need to wash clothes damn it's late it's too late for me to be washing clothes i think i have <laughs> I think I have enough clothes at least to Wednesday. I think I got enough clothes till Wednesday. So we should be good on that. And that's really it. That's all. That's that's it. That's all. I went to go see Camo and Kylo. I don't know. I probably put the little snippet in here, but it was no recording because y'all, Kylo, he is on 10. When I tell y'all he do not play around, he is so active now. Like that boy be jumping around, pulling it just a lot a lot a lot a lot so <laughs> i really had him like the whole time i was there like so i was occupied baby it wasn't no pulling out no camera for real so he's doing really really good and like it's so crazy just seeing him grow up i can't wait till he like bigger so like we could go start doing stuff like that's the stage i'm ready for but of course like we gotta cherish him like, while he's a baby because them times ain't gonna never come back but that was like the highlight of my day. Wow, I feel so grown. I feel so grown doing this. <laughs> but yes, yeah, that is it. That's it. That's all for this vlog. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Um, what did I do? 
Oh, it was a pretty good weekend. I was about to say this vlog probably boring, but I know it was a pretty decent weekend. It wasn't like me not doing nothing, but I didn't do a whole lot either. So it's kind of like right in the middle or whatever. So if you are new here, go ahead, stop what you're doing. Go back and watch some other videos. I ain't even gonna ask you to subscribe until you go back and really see, you know, what it's giving. But come back, watch the rest of this video. Well, the video is ending. But subscribe. If you are not new here and you are subscribed, thank y'all so, so much for supporting me. We is almost a 10K. Like, I could just feel it. I could just feel it. We almost there, y'all. So thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all. Like the videos because that is, I promise y'all, that's what's most important. Like the videos because that tells YouTube like, oh, they like this. Let's let's push it to this person. Let's push it to this person. Share the videos if you can. Turn on the post bell notification so y'all can be notified because I know some of y'all be like, wait, bro, hold on. I, I got to catch up. So turn on the post bell notifications and make sure you are subscribed if you've watched like two or three videos. Because at this point, if you watch two or three videos, like you're going to come back again. So just subscribe. It's free. It's free free but that's it that's all child i'm going to see you guys i guess i'll probably do another weekly vlog why not why not to let y'all see how this week goes i'm trying to be on my like healthier kick so we'll see how i maintain throughout the week and i'll just kind of update y'all on how the day went what i ate blah blah blah, blah. so good night and i'm gonna catch y'all on the next what on the next vlogster bye